we have a very cool excuse to cover an important concept relating to balsam fir. It appears this balsam fir fell, and we have access to the top foliage, the foliage at the top of the tree. This foliage is completely different from the foliage we'll find lower in the tree, the shaded foliage. Here's what I mean. Balsam firs produce two completely distinct types of foliage depending on whether the branch arises in the sun or the shade. Shaded leaves are produced in what's called a two-ranked arrangement, meaning they arise in a single plane. They depart the stem left and right, but they do not whirl around the stem. This is particular to shade leaves only. The leaves of a balsam fir that are produced in the sun, whether that be the top of a tree or a tree growing in an entirely exposed area, these leaves are whirled around the branch. They are not two ranked. They look more like the arrangement of a spruce, where they are radially aligned rather than in a single plane. But very often, an individual tree will have both. The lower branches will have these flattened needles on the left, and the upper branches will have these radially aligned needles on the right. We have shade leaves produced in the shade, sun leaves produced in the sun. Both needles will be characteristic of firs. They will have these paired white stomatiferous bands on the underside. The needles will be rounded and they will be flat in cross section. Here's the top of the tree that fell, completely covered in radially aligned sun needles. 